Oh yeah, you know, in uh, an earlier video, a while ago, I think it was, um, I think it was even last year, I don't know, but also almost a year ago, I posted a video where I showed you how I insulated the panorama roof. So basically, what I did, what I used, uh, let me show you. Okay, I used these. It's like a foam uh, you put in the speakers, and I buy them for like twenty dollars for five of them or something. And I use them to, you know, cover up the panorama roof. Uh, now I have gotten my hands in. Um, it's called sunshade, uh, panorama roof sunshade or something. So let me show you how it looks like. Uh, okay, okay. So you see now, it looks, I think it looks better now because before it was like, I mean, the, the panorama roof was like sagging down and it, it looked kind of cheap because, <laughs> yeah, it was that um, speaker foam thingy. Eh? And now it kind of looks, well, I don't have too much wide angle on this camera, but you see, you get the impression that now it's, um, it's better. Maybe, let me see. Maybe if I go to the back, hang on, hang on, let me just switch angle. Okay, I'm now in the back of the car and uh, it looks like this from here, from the back. So, you see, yeah, insulated the roof. Uh, it looks, it looks better in my opinion. And not only that, but uh, the roof doesn't sag that much like before. And um, yeah, let me see. Let me see if I can. Oh, ugh, this is too clumsy. Okay, I have to get get in the front again. Hang on. Okay, so you see, this is the front part. And uh, what I did was, you just squeeze it in. Let me take this off. Oh, focus, focus my camera. There. So you see, this is the the wire frame thingy and with a mesh here so what you do is you just you know squeeze it in like you would do without the the extra insulation and then i i had to cut some of that uh, before because yeah to fit it in there and now it's just a nice nice looking roof uh i guess you know in the summer i can take this off uh, in winter, it's not like I'm gonna you know, drive with open panorama roof anyway, so Yeah, this is great uh, It cost me, well, okay <laughs> uh, This thing cost me like $20 But this freaking thing, the original uh, Tesla accessory Cost like, uh, what was it again? Um, $150 or something for the set, the front and rear, so I would imagine that now that uh, there are like 2,500 Tesla more or less in China, you know, the Chinese people, they're gonna copy this and make, uh, yeah, cheap copies for, I don't know, how much? $20 maybe? Yeah. So this is, uh, this is great. I, I think this is great. I'm looking forward to, you know, driving in minus uh, 20 degrees Celsius in Norway. Uh, and as I said before, this roof, it it blocks the heat. I mean, not the heat. Well, it blocks the the absence of heat, or um, what you say, the the cold chill that comes from above. It would block it pretty pretty well, uh, which means um, when I'm driving in cold weather, I can um, I have better comfort in the in the car. So um, I experienced some cold weather with a loner car, the the S60. And when I was driving with a 60, I had to use, let's say, 21.5 degrees Celsius to, and it was still feeling a bit cold, but with this insulation, you know, I can get away with 20. Yeah, so I think it's great. So uh, I don't know about you guys, what do you think? Hmm?